books on nails. Thoughts on finding a man at an HBCU homecoming? Um, great question. So um, how would I do this? First of all, um, I wouldn't be hyper-focused on that. Why? Because a lot of these men are actually married and the other guys, like, respectfully speaking, sometimes those Morehouse brothers are messy. Howard brothers are another situation. But the focus needs to be on connection, not on can I get a man? Anytime you are going out and you're like, I need to get a man, I need to get a man, girl, that energy is thirsty and those men can smell it a mile away. Okay? So don't come with that energy. Come with the energy of, I want to connect with everybody. Do you know that energy is much more welcoming and you're actually going to attract men and not necessarily um, attract wolves? Because wolves are thirsty. You know those hyenas in The Lion King that will take any old scraps? That's the energy that you're giving. You're giving half-dead carcass when you're thirsty for the men, honey. Yeah? Your energy needs to be like, mm, I can take it or leave it. I'm just chatting and having fun with everybody. Okay? Someone said the wolves are howling in 2024. Yes, girl, it's giving Twilight Part 2 where the wolves took over, honey. That's what dating is like right now. Okay? All right. 